Hello everybody and a good day to you all. Today I'm talking about Stitchers episode number four, I See You. In this episode, Cameron finds a dead body. Now he used to, now he lives in an apartment building. And he used to live inside this, I guess you want to call it, I'm going to call it section for now. He used to live inside this section of the apartment. But he moved to another one. Inside the same apartment. So, this guy still gets his magazines. Even though he doesn't live there anymore, no the mag his magazines go to him. So he's tired of he's tired of this happening. He he goes down to this this, this guy's room to get to get his magazines back. Find the man dead. Dead as doornail, he ain't coming back. So he uses his team and Christian to jump her consciousness inside this man's body. And while she's poking around looking for things, she finds out that this guy, well, he is a peeping tom. That's right. He likes to watch people all day. He goes to work, he comes back home, he watches people. But, so, they, so they're trying to figure out, was he killed for something he saw, or was it something else altogether? So while Christian's inside of his consciousness looking around, because she only got a small window before his brain completely dies, and she tries to get, his, she tries to get clues from, what, from, the, from what's left in his, in his, in his consciousness. So while they are watching other people who this dead man watched, someone else is watching them. So it's like, who is watching the watchers? While the watchers are watching. Yes. So, but the person who, who, who's, who's watching them is from their past. Now, is this person going to help them or is this person going to hurt them? I don't know. But I'm on board to find out. I'm enjoying the show. I'm having a lot of fun watching it. It's a, it's a fun um, summer TV show. It's not the best thing in, in the world. I mean, there are some hiccups to it. But other, overall, I am enjoying it. I mean, the, the one who, uh, person who's not the, the strongest of the show is Emma Ishta. Now, she plays Christian, and she's the star of the show. But her performance is, well, pretty stiff and wet. It pretty, it, pretty, it pretty much is. Everyone else, the whole uh, cast around her... Is, is, is fine. But her performance alone, not so much. Now, I don't know if I, I thought she's playing that because the, the character she's playing is like emotionally cold because of her mental condition or she's just a bad actor. Eh. But either way, I'm still having fun watching the show. It's a whole lot of fun. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think about the show. Are you on board? Did you fall off? Do you hate it or do you love it? And tell me your theories. What do you think this person who's watching them is planning on doing? Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think. Give my channel a big old like. Hit the thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel and share. I really would appreciate that. So like I always say, in my dreams and in real life, I am the Ninja Rabbit. A oh, peace out. Oh, peoples. Shazam!